Hi everyone, today I will talk about how I handle images and videos, uh, medias in Obsidian and uh, this video will be especially useful for people in uh, using Obsidian Publish because uh, as you know, like um, Obsidian Publish only allows uh, you to upload up to 4 gigabytes of image and videos to, to, the, to your website and then each media, the maximum size of the maximum size of each media is only 50 maps. And that's why, like, uh, I think uploading uh, to a cloud, uh, like Cloudinary, be, will be a good idea. And uh, the plugin that I'll be using uh, is um, is uh, Cloudinary, and then I just install it, and then um, I go to the options, and then I see a bunch uh, of settings here. The uh, the main three things that you need to set is like the cloud name, upload template, and the upload folder. So um to use this plugin you first need to create a cloudinary account and then when you go to the dashboard of your cloudinary account you can see all your credentials so basically you can copy the cloud name here and then um you can also set the folder path uh, when you go to the media explorer uh uh, yeah, you, you you can set the folder path of your of, of your of your media uh, of the obsidian and then uh, if you go to settings uh, and then you go to the upload tab uh, you can see there there are some upload presets uh, you can create one unsigned uh, upload preset uh, here it has uh, it told you the reason why he used uns uh, the author want to use uh, unsigned upload preset and after you create an unsigned upload preset copy the name of your presets to your settings and it will work so uh, what what is the outcome the outcome is something like that um let's say i've so, uh, i've image uh let's say i've image uh of this image and i copy this i just paste it here you can see that uh it will return a url and then i, I can see the image here right so the good thing about this is that whenever i upload an image it will never store in my local vault and it is stored in the cloud and it is super useful and super handy um i also use this with um uh uh the um, the raycast the raycast uh a culinary plugin for example if i search culinary and then i see search asset right i will see all the um uh, images that i've uploaded and it uh, you can search it really easily and all the images and videos are separated from uh from from your obsidian vault and yeah i hope you enjoy this video this is how i um handle images and like um because of these i can basically ignore these limitations and uh i don't also also i don't when when i use link when i use link i will not see all the attachments uh, appear in in the search results i hope you learned something in the video uh if you like this video please like and subscribe to my channel and yeah i'll see you next time